Next up, we have another fifth round pick. And this is a guy uh, who a lot of you guys will know because he's he actually was a, a solid pick for us, actually. One of the more solid late round picks of the Jerry Reese era, you could say. Jerry Reese was not known Fair. for doing pretty well in the mid to late rounds. He was he was usually pretty solid the first one or two rounds. Past that, it was all... Mm. Um, <laughs> but yeah, round five, 174th overall pick, which is a comp- compensatory pick. Uh, Devin Kennard, linebacker out of USC. And yeah, he played 52 games for us overall. 35 starts in his four seasons with the, with the Giants there. Uh, this is a guy who end up becoming a starter for us. How many times do you get a fifth round pick that's a starter? You know, he's kind of like the, uh, you know, it, it, like the the idea of like Darius Slayton on defense, basically that like late round pick you don't expect to start somehow sticks around. He's not elite, but, but he's good enough to hold down his job for a few years. That kind of thing, like yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah. That's that's Fair. where I kind of look at Kennard at that point. So um, again, fifty two games, thirty five starts. 203 tackles, one interception, eight passes deflected, three forced fumbles, two fumbles recovered, nine and a half sack, 23 tackle for losses, and 22 QB hits with the New York Giants there. He then spent two seasons with the Lions, two and a half with the Cardinals, and then a few games with the Ravens in 22. Uh, Last season was his first season not in the NFL, and he actually announced his retirement via LinkedIn in October 2023. So the biggest thing I take away from that is Somebody actually finally figured out how to use LinkedIn. Yeah. Besides <laughs> us streaming on it. Hi, LinkedIn people. <laughs> yeah. I think it's like that social media nobody knows what to do with. It's supposed to be all about professional things that you do. So congrats to Kanar for actually using it for something that's professional. <laughs> uh, and not, overall, and not post a podcast. <laughs> exactly. Not post a sports podcast on it. That's like yeah. weekend. Oh my god. Uh career wise, 118 games overall, 74 starts, 357 tackles, one interception, 10 passes deflected, four four force fumbles, six fumble recovery, including one for a touchdown, 26 and a half sacks, 54 tackles for loss, 63 QB hits there. So solid career. Like I said, for a fifth round pick, that's a solid career, guys. Uh, that's definitely a hit that 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 pick there for us. Uh, both for what he did for the Giants and what he did in his career as a whole. Um, Apparently, he's also now written a book. He's an author. He's wrote a book that all adds up, Designing Your Game Plan for Financial Success. He's all about the finance stuff now. So he's a real estate investor. He also gets hired as a speaker for events talking about finances and leadership. He also owns uh, 42 Solutions, which is a lending company. Um, So, yeah, he's all around the place there. So... Uh, 42, by the way, for those who might have missed it in the beginning, when I showed the picture for those in the video, is his was his jersey number at USC. So, you know, he definitely uses football stuff for that there as well. So, you know, kudos to him because he really seems to have his stuff together as far as setting himself up with a nice career in life outside of football when he was when he time to announce last year he was done. And like I said, had a good career on top of that. He probably made a decent amount of money there. Uh, I know his lending company, based on the, what their website said, was already lent out four million dollars to people for things like building homes on on empty land, upgrading homes, that kind of stuff. That's what they seem to specialize in, at least according to what I saw on the website. It's nice the websites are there now; it's easier to track down people are up to. <laughs> it's kind of <laughs> kind of scary, but kind of cool at the same point. <laughs> so again, solid pickup though. This is pro. This is probably the second best pickup in this draft to OBJ. Probably That's, because of that. Because where you got him and his longevity. And how oh, yeah. Played. Like I said, his, yeah. that's a value pick right there, guys. That is a value pick. Thanks for listening to Two Giant Goofballs, a New York Giants podcast. We appreciate your support. Thanks so much.